Hello and welcome back to an episode of Medieval Dynasty. We are in the village. I am looking at everything we have done so far. We are, we're getting pretty close. We're getting pretty close. I mean, if I look at the farming technology, we're getting to the barn level two or level three, so that's still in the, on the, in the works. And of course, the windmill. Once we hit the, hit the windmill, then we are done with this run. I think we have done built pretty much everything that we have ever busy, basically built. Except the swing head level three. Yeah, it's coming up. It's coming along. It's quite nice. I like the swing head level three. Um, all these beautiful things, these uh, large parts, large saddlebags, and everything else. They are worth so much money. Not that I need money at the moment. I'm working. <laughs> I'm seeing around the forty thousand coin at the moment. That's pretty, pretty good, I think. Resource storage hut level three is coming up. For the building technology, we already have everything for the survival technology, except for fishing at level two. That would be nice to upgrade something uh, for that. So it's mostly um, the production technology and the farming technology that we are waiting for. The last little bits of tech there. And of course, the tavern. So we can start going into the beer business. <laughs> All right. So what have I been doing while you have been uh, away? Well, mostly just producing stuff, which is why producing and selling stuff which is why of course uh, we have so much coin we have 48,201 coin which is quite nice that means I can basically buy whatever the hell I want and cutting a whole bunch more horses if I wanted to but I don't really care much for horses anymore I already have the horse I have and I'm pretty happy with that also the fact that you can just simply uh, fast travel from from village to village with the uh, wagoneers makes it so much easier you don't really technically need a horse to do that kind of stuff if you wanted a horse it would mostly be used for travel between the villages not from a village to another village so if you want to go to into the mountains for instance or that kind of thing then you can use a horse but for the rest it doesn't really make much sense to have a horse i mean it does it, they, they do carry quite a lot oh, it just disappeared from there <laughs> oh there he is I just don't, I don't know why they keep appearing behind me. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, I know, I know. So, we got some more logs in here. I'm just going to grab those logs out of you. Put them back in here where we have the space. Now, what are we going to do this episode? Quite simply, um, we have unlocked the food storage at level 3. This puppy. So, it's a new building, and I want to build it over there where we have our current food storage. That one. Replace that with a level three, so we're gonna have to destroy quite a bit to put it in the place there, and then we'll just have to build it up again. I, I think I'm gonna have to remove the, the 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 wall here, that wall there. I'm pretty sure. I don't think I need to move the house. I think that'll be fine. But everything else around here will most likely have to be moved. So let's go get a hammer. Let's get this puppy destroyed, and then we'll see what we can do with the level three. The level three is a is a is a quite a large upgrade. Uh, uses, I think it's mostly logs, but I'm not quite sure. We'll, we'll, we'll see. I haven't built this one in a while. <laughs> now, I also have some skills to upgrade, so we also have to do that. We have extraction skills, so we can go put something in there. Miner strands would be nice. This, I mean, the mule, the careful miner, is also quite nice, although I don't really mind that much anymore because I already have all these miners that do it for me. Master of Destruction, Extraction Knowledge. I think I'll just I'll just uh, stick it in the Treasure Hunter. I mean, Force of Nature is quite nice. I mean, 5% loss of access is okay, but I don't really care because I have so much coming in that I don't really mind my access destroying anymore. 10% uh, faster digging and... Nah, I don't really care about that either. Minus Trance, no, nope, not really. Ex extraction, nah. <laughs> That's the only thing I can think of. That might be worth something is this one. Careful miner. So we'll just put it in there. We'll just put it in there. And it doesn't really matter. Extraction, we, we don't we don't do any more work anyway, because we already have so many villagers to do it for us. So the farming. Knight rider, that's what I want, I want to go for. Or skilled rider is also quite ten percent slower. Um so the uh, stamina uh, mounts stamina so you can run further. That's quite nice. This is also quite nice so we can run faster, but I think uh, I'll just keep stick, stick to the skilled rider one. I mean, we do have the option to put it in the skilled orchard, so we get some more orchards. But I don't really harvest anything with orchards, so that's that's a bit of a waste. So this will be fine for me. So I can actually um, I can actually uh, run a bit further with my horse. I'm going to put two put both of those points in there, so we get like a 25 percent slower mount stamina because so we can run 25 percent further, which is great. Now the best thing I have at the moment 
is this. We have some point. We have a one point to spend in diplomacy, which is great because I can put it in diplomat so I can get more dynasty reputation points. That way we can get uh, more people quite fast, which is quite nice. I like that. Uh, I can put it in inspiring speech so I get 10% faster production. So my villagers do better work. I can put them in hand of of the king, so I get twenty five percent chance to get away with. Them. If I fail him, then the king doesn't get too angry at me. I'm not quite sure exactly what would happen. The king was completely angry at me. So does he come after my ass? I don't know. I'm not quite sure. Mood reduction. I don't care about. My people are very very happy. This are um, yeah. So these two last ones are the most uh, impressive ones. I I expect because I, I I would like to be able to pay less taxes and being able to have less. A 10% lower demand on food and wood by the villagers is also useful. Now, I have a lot of money, and I don't think that's going to to change anytime soon. I'm also not able to build anything, um, well, more buildings. So the, the amount of taxes that we currently pay will only go up with higher tier buildings, which, of course, will have to take a while before we get that far. So the 10% lower taxes doesn't really matter to me. Castle that is much better because that gives us 10% lower food demand. It makes it a little bit easier to manage the village because they don't eat that much mu uh, food and they don't take much, as much wood as before. So I'm going to go in Castellan and have them work on that. So now, technically speaking, I am a castle of the village. <laughs> so now my villagers uh, eat less and uh, spend less, which is great. Excellent. So that's, that makes it everything a little bit better. I'm not quite sure how that would function. Um, I have been slowly upgrading all these houses where people have been living in. So everybody seems to be very happy at the moment. So the mood, the lowest I have at the moment is, let me just scroll up to the top here, 41%. It would take a lot for this person to leave. So I'm pretty sure that the, I'm, pr I'm pretty confident with the with the, the happiness level of my people. So that's, that's pretty good. And the highest level is 87. This is Alice. She lives in that house. Oh, wait, the, which house? Yes. So that house over there, and she is as happy as I could possibly get them to be, right? She has a baby, she's married, she lives in a nice warm house, um, close to some uh, close, to, close to water. She has a little table in front of the house. She is as happy as I could possibly get this person, <laughs> and that is at eighty-seven percent. I can't, I can't for some reason, I can't get it any higher than that. I mean, the only way I can get her, get her higher is to get her back to work again. I think she would like to get back to work. I'm not quite sure. She currently is profession is, is mother, so she can't work until the baby's back into uh, back. Uh, I mean, w able to walk around and do its own thing. So that'll take a, about a year. Wait, what is the baby called again? This one is called. Um, ooh, yeah, you just oh, so cute. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. You just do that. All right, so the baby is named here Amelia, and Amelia works lives with her parents. Of course, it's pretty sad that she still does that, but she's at seventy-two percent happiness level, which is quite nice. Now the baby would, of course, uh, stay at the same hap happiness level as the uh, mother. So the mother is a low happiness, um, then uh, the baby will be a low happiness, but. Uh, when we have, I, I've gone to all the houses and stuff and upgraded all the houses in uh, regards to insulation with anybody who has a baby, so it's pretty good. So, um, what are we going to do? We're going to go take this puppy apart. So, let's put the, put the hammer in, you, in one, put it on destruction, and let's go get busy. So, let's get rid of this road and this uh, bit of fencing. There we go. Let's get rid of you, and you, and you, and you. Yes, it's all going to go down. Look at that. And of course the framing, and then the floor. But uh, now it's back to build. All right, so this is a spot of play. Well, let's just, let's just remove this as well. I don't think this is going to be helpful once we start the build. All right, so actually we have a bit of space here. Perfect. Let's go see if we can actually build it. Oh, yes, I need to get rid of this thing as well. This thing needs to go as well. There we go. That's perfect. Let's build it. So we want to have this puppy, um, the, the storage hut, level three, food storage hut level three, positioned right here. Let's see if we can, if we can move it into position if it wants to. 
it doesn't like its position at the moment. <laughs> I'm not quite sure why that is. It's going to remove everything, including the, the wooden plates and so on. But, 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 you, you too. Wait, why can't I pick you up? There we go. Done. We got a bit more space. I'm thinking I'm going to remove this as well here. Let's get rid of this road. Wait, why can't I get rid of you? Come on, come on. I'm just, I'm just trying to get rid of the road. There we go. <laughs> yeah, that's good. All right, so we have a bit more space. Perfect. So let's see if we can put this the puppy down now. Storage. And then food storage level three. Now it fits. Now it wants to fit. All right, so that's okay. We don't, not that f well, How far can we put you? Let's see if we can get you as close to that. Maybe it's the road behind. Seems to be a bit of pathing here as well. Let's get rid of this part here. Seems to be unnecessary in the first, in any way, because there's already a, a road path there. So I'm not quite sure why there's two of them. And right, that should be good. Let's see. Oh, I'm so encumbered at the moment. I have so many logs in my pocket. Let me just drop some off over here. And then we will continue. So let's get, drop you off. Come on, get, come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Done. So that feels a lot better already. <laughs> All right, so let's set uh, let's set the position. Food storage level two, building storage level three. That's the one we want. Why can't I put you down? Why don't you want to? There's, okay, it's green there. Let's see how far we can go. We can't um, that way. We can go, but we can't go that way. Can we go further back? Not a big deal. I think I want to put you there. I think that'll be the good spot for you. There. So now we still have some space back here. So this path is still going to work, which is good. And then we also have space here for a road. So we can we can put back the road that goes from here. Like like that. All the way back down to the central path over here. Like that. And we'll build the fencing back again and uh the tables and the chairs and everything else but right now we need to get um let's put on this, this stone it's too bad that we can't get a hundred percent of the stone no, I, I also one thing i have to correct In the last episode i said that you couldn't drink directly from the well actually as a matter of fact you can <laughs> you just go to the well and you can just drink like this and just zip uh, there we go drunk we are perfectly fine that's uh something i do like about this uh, the update the most recent update that, that allows you to drink straight away it's excellent and then we don't have to worry about thirst anymore not well we are so close to the uh to a well I put the bowl away the plate and the clay jug i think they'll be fine let's get some more stone and a couple more stones and i think it's a whole bunch of logs <laughs> a thousand stones what is wrong okay when i don't build anything i just collect a whole bunch of stones maybe it's a good idea to start selling some of these stones. Let's go sell these stones off. Um, we got a thousand stone. That's a lot. I don't know really what I'm going to do with all that stone. And I also don't really know what to do with all of you. I'm going to leave my plates. I'm stop selling my plates away. I, I think I'm going to need my plates. Yep. And I'm going to set these stones in sale instead. So whoever wants to have stone for their building, whatever, you can come and buy them here. No problem. No questions. What else do I have? I also have a production problem. The kitchen level two over here has no more resources for potage. The cabbage is now completely finished. So we can't get any potage anymore. No big deal. So remove that. I don't really care. We already have so much other foods that we can eat. We have in total 16,288 units of food. 6,900 uh, units of wood, uh, firewood and stuff, and 12,310 units of water. So I'm, I'm pretty good. We can, I'm pretty confident we can survive anything coming up. Oh, ships, don't do that. Don't do that. All right, let's just put down these stones for a second. I think I'll just stack them up over here. So bip, bip, like that. You stay there. I'll grab you. So we've got a whole bunch more logs. More logs than I should be able to carry, but that's okay. Get this puppy built. There we go, like that. This is going to be a 
Well, it's, it's, let's see. What do we need for the walls? Stone and logs. All right, so that's we, we're going to need those stones. <laughs> I do like that some of the level three huts uh, use stone. Some of them use wood. It's kind of different. Okay. So one more log here, one more log there. Yeah, I just hammer it all in. Let's go up. Come on, come on, come on. You can do it, you can do it. No. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. Uh, nope. Yes, we're up. <laughs> Get that one there. Up. Ah, ships. I fell down again. More logs there. I think this window here, this roof also needs a log. Yep. And then some log there. I think that one already did, right? Oh, stuck. That bit of oh no, need a log there as well. Okay, all the roof parts are done. We just need to get all the uh, so the wall parts are also done. See this little bit here. That requires a little bit more wood. Right, no big deal. We'll get some more wood. Let's first grab some of these stones. Where we get them? Here we go. Here we go. Twenty-two stones. Let's start with the door. Get this in place. Like that, and then you as well. I think that the best uh, way to get more personnel without having to use, um, what do you call it, uh, dice repetition points, is to have the babies grow up to become fully fully adults. But that takes that takes eighteen years. It's a lot of seasons. <laughs> to be honest, that's a lot of seasons. Let's see what else can we do. I mean, my the game's not really happy with the fact that I have one more thing in my my tool store. Okay, so I, need, I still need to get cludgels. For some reason, I completely run out of that. And it's the poison bronze bolt. I don't need, I don't I don't have many of those anymore because I don't make any more of those. That makes sense that they're asking for that. So we need to have more stone and a couple more more logs. So let's grab some more stones. Oh, the stones have gone down fast. I just I only put them on sale like a couple seconds ago. <laughs> let's grab some logs as well. Uh, and then we'll go for the planks. La, 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 la. I think this should... No, too many. That should do it. That should do the amount of logs that we need. All right, excellent. So what we need to do is just finish the window, I mean the, the, the walls, and then we can focus on the planks and the roof and stuff. Right? That shouldn't be too much trouble. So let's finish you off as well, and then let's get ready with you. Yeah, I got a little bit too many logs. That's all done. That's all done. I hear a little baby giggling. So I moved a family over into this house. And now they are happily living here. The reason why I moved them here is because I, I upgraded this roof to a uh, to a plank one, a very high level plank one. So it's uh, the, the highest level plank. So it's, it's this, this family is incredibly happy. Iwona. Well, I'm incredibly happy. I mean, like, I could probably make them pretty happy. She's already at level, she's already at 75% happiness. She went up from, because she lived in one of those huts down there, right? With well, water uh, huts, with a poor roof and pretty shitty building, right? <laughs> Material over the, over the walls. So I moved them from there into that house, which is so much better. And their happiness just skyrocketed. So I'm pretty happy with that. I mean, I don't really know why I need to care about the happiness of my villagers. I mean, the only thing that really matters is if they want to stay or want, if they're going to go. So if they they want to stay, then you're then basically this doesn't really matter. But if they're going to go, then that of course is a bit of an issue. But you don't want you you don't want your people to leave your village, because then you lost all that nice reputation points that you invest in them. I'm not quite sure if you get those back. I've never actually lost anybody. But okay, let's go drop these logs off. Let's grab some more stones. And then we can grab some more, um, some planks as well. So 50, 50 pla stones, there we go. And some planks. There we go, yes. Like uh, like that, that's a good, good number of planks. We are also, of course, encumbered. Grab my horse. I hear you, horse. I'm just not sure where you are. Are you back here? Oh, there he is. It's quite cool. You can actually call the horse 
um, while inside the building. <laughs> so let's just let's just leave it there. And uh, let's see. Let's go finish off this little bit of wall here. We've got two pieces left to do. And then I think we should. Then we can go on to the roof. Get that built. Excellent. So we got some cabbage here. <laughs> And some uh, pears and apples, and I'm not quite sure. This looks like some kind of coagulated uh, pear thingy that has uh, it's just merged together into some kind of indescribable, uh, I don't know. This is something you would find in Nurgle's, Nurgle's uh, uh, domain. All right, so this is, uh, I'm going to stand over here and just call the horse over. Come on, your horse. Where's the horse? Oh, there you are. Good horsey. Good, good, good horsey. I'll put the stones in your pocket for now. So you got, you still got some space for this, but okay. Let's go and finish this roof. So it takes six per, per uh, roof section, so segments. So that's uh, not that bad. I actually expected it to be 12. But, eh. Don't worry, horse. I'm just standing here. Just leave me alone. So this is the highest tier roof, and this is the almost highest tier this is just the second tier um roofing style it's not as insulated as uh the level the, the top level people seem to like that last level there we go food storage hut level three so let's see how much space we have now so we had uh close to three thousand now we have five thousand so this one single hut has given us two additional thousand uh, storage. That's great. And is it, is there more information we can get? Um, copious amounts of storage, cap uh, more capacious and more sturdy than the simple version. Capacity of storage is shared. Okay, well that's great. So we got this beautiful building, all ready to go in our village. We don't have to worry about that. Uh, we should add some uh, tables. Let's add some st some tables. I think I have planks right now with me, so I should be able to do that right now. Uh, tables. Let's see, wooden table needs logs. <laughs> I need some logs. Let's grab some logs, and I want to. I think we have a. I think we already have a. Um, what do you call this again? A lantern post there. Should already be a lantern post. We have this one in the center of the village here. But is there already a lantern? Yeah, we already have this thingy here. So this is a uh, kind of like a lantern, but it's uh, it's a simpler version. It's cheaper as well. Just takes linen thread and some stones and stuff and a stick. It's pretty good. Let's put a table down. Let's put the wooden table down. Let's put you here. Like that. Boom. Right by the torch. Perfect. And let's also put some chairs down. So seats. Let's put a, a log bench. Should we? Should we do not the log bench? Let's put the different type of bench. Let's put the bench, the the better version. This is the the wood bench. It takes four planks. I only have two left. What? What happened to all my planks? <laughs> and you don't have any more planks in you, do you? Uh, let's go up some more planks, and then we can get some more. I think we don't need any more logs. I think we got enough logs. Let's grab some more planks instead. Then we'll have enough to finish off those seats. Like that, boom, perfect. And then with those planks, those those chairs, people should be able to sit here and enjoy their meal, whatever they're eating, right? That's what we want. We want them to enjoy the meal that they're they're sharing or taking or partaking in. There we go, like that. And then wait, do we still? I need to be able to move in and out of that spot there. So I'm not quite sure if this is gonna. Let's just let's just turn you around. Can we, can we not rotate you? Yes, we can. And that's as far as you want to go. All right, fine. Oh, wait, shit. <laughs> it's not where I want you. Let's try this again. So, decorations, seats, uh, that. Let's just turn you around. So, that is green there. Boom, beautiful. All right, excellent. Let's put that to build. 
And we need to put something on the table so we can... Um, so it makes it look like they actually ate something. And I think I have 12 plants. What kind of a fence can I make? I can make the wooden fence. I don't have the money to buy it though. The wooden fence takes planks, I think. But it also looks better. So let's go ahead and buy some. Let's buy that, that scheme. Let's also get some more planks. And then we should be able to, to, uh, to build that. So just some coin. So, like 50,000 coin, that's a bit much. <laughs> I didn't expect we would go over the 50,000 coins so fast. Let's grab you, grab you as well. Let's see, any more gates? I have the wooden gate and I have the log gate. Let's just open up that and that. Uh, decorations. I think I already opened up most of this stuff. So, roads. No, I don't want to build a road. What, what am I doing? No, no. <laughs> All right, let's see, we got some more uh, planks. That's a log. No, I'm looking for plank. There we go. Plank. So this is put like 50 more planks in my pocket. Perfect. All right. Let's see if we can build this little bit of, uh, of a, uh, a fence thing. Now we already have the stone fencing or stone walls. So I think this is going to be a bit different. Fence. Let's see. A wooden fence. We want the wooden fence to go from this corner. All the way across to this a little bit of fencing here. And then, yeah, it takes planks. Three, two. So we'll have a little bit of a, a plank fence. It's quite nice. Look at that. I like it. I'm not quite sure how they managed to, to make it. I mean, they must have they must have broken some of these fences in two or whatever. I mean, there's, these, these boards, these planks. There we go. Look at that. Yeah, you like it too, don't you? <laughs> I like it. All right, so let's just get rid of this bit of fencing here. Destroy you, boom, and then you. And let's just upgrade this one to... Uh, I want to continue the stone fence. I think that that's the nicest. So from there, green to over to there. Like that. You need some stone. Didn't you have stone in your pocket? I think you did. Yes. So I'll put the logs in your pocket. Give me the stone. Yeah, yeah. Don't worry. We got enough stones. Five, four, three, two, one. Last one. Perfect. I actually might be able to make uh, to put more tables in the spot. That'll be, maybe I'll be able, able to do that. I think I'll be able to. I also want to get rid of you. I want to upgrade you to a higher tier version of yourself. So if I can move the table a bit closer to the wall, yeah, I can put another table over here. That'd be perfect. We can have a little bit like a little restaurant thing, Maji. Yeah, let's get rid of you, you, and you. Let's see if we can build. Let's see. Um, fence decorations, tables. Let's put another one of you. Oh, I need more logs. I put all the logs I had in the horse. The horse's ass. Okay, let's open up. There you go. Eight. Jump over this. Don't mind me, people. Just keep going about your business. Uh, decorations, tables, and then we want the wooden table. So let's put it against the wall, like so. See if we can. A little bit further back like that. Excellent. And then we'll put some chairs, some seats. So you, not you. So we'll put you over here. I, I saw it was green for a second. Come on. I know you want to. There we go. There. And then the next one, that's a wooden table. <laughs> Decoration seats, the wooden bench, and then let's just turn you around because this is going to be one heck of a weird position to work in. And then this one goes there. As close as I could get to that table. Perfect. All right, let's just build one more table. Oh, we need more logs. I mean, more planks. Planks are all finished. So you grab some more planks. And then I think we should be able to start decorating it with other stuff. Let's go grab some more planks. Plank, 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 plank. There we go. So 14, 15, 20, 20 planks. Perfect. That should be enough. And we we can't really carry more than that. I mean, we can, we can still run and stuff, but I don't want to overburden myself. Let's put another table over here. Tables. That one. That one. And let's put you like right against the wall. Like so. 
Right opposite from you, right? Eh, kind of. <laughs> Seats, a wooden bench, then we put you right there. <clears throat> like a bit, little bit restaurantish, I think. Now we just need to put a. Um... Oh, hello. You seem very angry. Bloody hell. You see that face? <laughs> Let's put a, um, a, 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 one of these things. What do they call them again? They, they, uh, bloody hell. Lighting a lantern. Let's put a lantern. We need leather and wool. Wool thread. Should have loads of those. Let's go get some wool thread. All the way to the bottom. Boom. We got 18 wool thread. We just need four. And then we need, um, what's the sticks or what's the, um, leather. We need leather. Stop hitting things. Leather. Uh, la, 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 la. I've had a bit of a problem with leather lately, but this seems to have gone up quite considerably. So we need four leather. Now we should be able to make our beautiful little lantern. Oh, look at it. <laughs> I really like the lantern. It's a nice thing. Now I want this thing to also work. No, oh, it doesn't want to get installed there. So we can put it like that. That way it still light the, the road a little bit. And then you still have some light to get into the uh yeah, into the into the food storage. And I think yeah, I can't really put a light inside the food storage, which I'm a bit of a bit of a, it's a bit of a problem. Maybe I can't I can't decorate either. Bloody hell. Why can't I decorate? I want to put some stuff on the wall, like a candle or something. <laughs> no, don't hit things. Uh alright, so we just have to do this little bit of wall here. do I have any more stone? I have 26 stone. I should be able to. Let's go ahead and put this wall here. It's a little bit of wall. Right to that corner there. Boom. Yeah, we should have enough. Excellent. And then you, you'll last a little bit. Like so. Perfect. Now we can move between here. And still be able to travel uh, onwards with this route. Oh, perfect. I like it. And then all we have to do... Uh, can I make a candle? Is that something I can make? Kind of, kind of wondering. Because I can make candles in the buildings and stuff. I can do that as decoration. I can put down a bit of decoration like here. I can put down one of these things. A hanging lantern and stuff at. All beautiful things. Um, but can I put down... I don't think I can put down a candle. I don't think I can. I don't think I can. Let's dump all our stuff. Let's go take a nap. So the date is... Uh, map. It's actually day 15. So the next day will be in the summer. So we can actually start looking into... Oh, not the wrong house. <laughs> I don't want to live in somebody else's house. I've seven, hey, this is what I mean. This is a beautiful candle. Right? Now, I'm not quite sure if I can actually make that uh, myself. Because it would be cool if I could. So let's see. Do we have any wicker and wooden? So do we have any candle? Can we have a torches, simple torches and stuff, but nothing candle-ish. So that's a bit of a shame. But anyways, let's go take a nap. And then um, we will see what happens in the morning. So we still have some, we have some things to do. I like my room. I like my house. Let's see to the next season. Boop. Yeah, look at that. Good morning. And now we got to pay taxes. <laughs> but all my trees are in bloom. And let's see how much taxes I have to pay, actually. 18,700. What the f... That's a lot. <laughs> so we need to go and talk to the castellan and uh pay him the money so that he will be less inclined to be pissy at me uh 109 out of 110 billions we still have a couple buildings that we can actually build now the thing is i still want to build i think i should i should build sometime the hunting lodge level the hunting fish no, sorry, the fishing hut level two i currently only have one of those um one of those fishing huts we can build a level two it doesn't take much but I'm not entirely sure why. I, I don't even like the fishing thingy. I don't I don't don't really like it at all actually. <laughs> now I need to have all of this harvested 
before the end of the season so I can also have it planted because right now we are in planting planting season. Springtime is the best season to plant so I'm most likely going to have to help. Well, wheat over here is still not grown, fully grown. This is rye so we'll be harvesting all the rye. I want to replace because I want to keep the wheat grasses here the, the same. This is all going to be wheat. So these are all going to be, these wheat fields are going to be uh, extended over to these fields as well. These are also going to be wheat fields. So this is field level 32, for instance. 32. So that's all the way down to the bottom. Those are orchards. So field 31 and 32 need to be, uh, let's see, change that to wheat. So let's go ahead and put that down. So plant wheat here. Bloom. Yes, I accept that. And same goes for 32. Change the plant type wheat. Plant it all the way to the wheat there. Beautiful. And then the rye, the fields for the rye. Um, we're gonna we're gonna have to have a bit more fields. Actually, as a matter of fact, I don't I don't have enough fields at the moment. So my guess is we'll need to start using some of the, some of the space over here for more fields, so that we can we can plant um, oats. Uh, but we're going to harvest all of our rye and replace that with, um, yeah, with all these fields over here are going to be replaced with, uh, with flax. So we'll have a ton, a ton of flax coming out of this in the next season. So the, all these fields here will need to be uh, harvested and then we'll be replacing them with flax. Did you hear something? I heard something. I heard a cow. My cow is doing something weird again. My name is Maximus Aurelius, whatever. Let's see, what do you need from me now? Services, you need tool stall. You don't have any wooden spears anymore. Okay, that makes sense. I didn't actually make any more wooden spears because I'm, I was using the logs. I need the logs. The resource hut, you don't have any more stone. Seriously, we went through stone that fast? Holy ships. <laughs> that's a lot, of, a lot of stone. We had over a thousand stone. That's all gone. How the hell did you manage that? That was fast. Holy ships. Well, that, that's a lot of money then. We must have made a lot of money. Although stones are not really that expensive. So the cows are coming out. Are you guys coming out to play? No? Mama cow and baby cow and... Mama cow needs a bucket to be... Uh, to be... Um, to get harvested. Or needs harvest <laughs> to get milked. Hello sheepies. Look at them all. Fluffy as hell. All right, well, they'll get, they'll get uh, sheared, and they'll get milked, except for the bull. I'm not quite sure if you should milk a bull. I mean, you, I'm pretty sure you can, <laughs> but you shouldn't. Um, and we should focus on what this, this season is in, which is, of course, let's go to the map. So we do have some more quests to do. Now, if we want to hire somebody else, and of course, I want to hire somebody else. I need a, another worker, a couple. Actually, I needed like 10 more workers, but I can only afford like one. We need to go to 11,500 Dynasty Reputation. That's what we need, right? And uh, as good as I am, I didn't actually, I didn't put them in the diplomacy and stuff. So we get some more, not experience, I mean, the um, diplomat. So we get some more Dynasty Reputation points. Um, that would have been nice, but I didn't because I, I, I feel that that's uh, unnecessary. Got you built. You look good. You look good. And we have everything else is okay. Everything else seems to be going good. Let's leave that all over it alone. I mean, we could put another seat down here, but I'm not quite sure if I want to do that right now. We got some more seats here. Everybody can relax and do their thing. I'm gonna put a little bit of a road here to the uh, to the door. It's nice and clean. Look at that. Perfect. All right. I, I like that. <laughs> It looks good. Village is coming along nicely. Got some trees over here. I want to get more of these trees and then plant them around the place. But the thing is that they always have to be planted on an orchard area. So let's see. We can we can we can put farming. We can put another orchard here. I think or maybe two. No, doesn't look like that. Doesn't like that at all. But let's try this again. You. I need you over there. And then two slots. So there, I could put them there. Uh, do I want to? I think I, I think I do. Building, farming, farming, and then orchard. Let's put one here. Oh, bloody hell. 
Nope, wrong one. Farming orchard. I need you here. What? Why can't you? Why can't I build you? Come on. <laughs> Try this again. Farming orchard. That seems to be okay. But I don't want it there. Oh, bloody hell. So it's like that, and then all the way across. It doesn't seem to want to do that part. Let's see, you can do that. And then I think I don't have enough space for one more. No. It doesn't want to do two. It can only do one at the moment, so that's not good. I don't like that at all. It's going to destroy you. Try this again. Farm. Orchard. So we can try from this side. Let's try from this side. Come on, you, you, it was working before. <laughs> no, I don't want a water fence. Building, farming, orchard. So let's try this again. So if we can put you there. Uh, it doesn't like it. It was working before. It, it, we managed to get it to work. No, it's too slow. Small. Hmm. Ships. Farming there. Maybe if I move it a little bit further, like I can, is it green here? That's green. I saw the green, there we go, that's some green there. Uh, that works, that works. Then we have quite close to the wall, we have two little orchard fields. I mean, we could put another third one over here, but I think that those two will be fine. Let's go get, can I also put an orchard here? Will that fit? No. I don't think so. I don't think so. Uh, let's try it from the other different angle. Let's put, like, for instance, you. No, you. <laughs> You're inside the building. That doesn't work at all. Let's try this again. Farming, orchard. Uh, nope. Uh, farming, orchard. No, it doesn't fit. It doesn't fit. It's too, too little space there. Too little space. We can't put a tree there. I wish I could put like a random tree right here. That would be nice. Farming, try you here. Nope, doesn't like it. Doesn't like it. Doesn't like it one bit. So we'll have to wait for that. So have you guys made more babies? I think Dogma uh, Bogna is stuck. Bogna can't get out anymore. Uh, we'll have to keep a track on um, the farming in the future. I need to move people from the... Uh, the previous professions back into farming again. So let's see. We need to go back to farming. That is not farming. That is not farming. This is farming. So let's go here. So I need to have people that have the highest level. So Bogma is a is a uh, animal breeder. So was she? I don't know if she was. Hmm. Not sure. Oh, now Moj. Now Moj. Why is he a miner? Oh yeah, he was. He used to be. He used to work in the farm. So we can move him out of the excavation shed and to the barn. Yeah, let's move him to the barn and let's have him a farmer. Well, he can get back to work. And then we have the Gnimir, who is currently a stall owner, but he was also a farmer before. But he's level seven. His diplomacy went up like crazy. Look at that. Emmerich is a animal breeder. We'll leave him alone. Uh, Wigbert, that's the that's the barn where Nomoj is a farmer. Uh, ships. So uh, Bernard's zero years old, so I don't think he can do anything. Nirutka, mother, she's level ten in diplomacy. She, as soon as she's no longer mother, we'll put her back in the stall. So we can put Gnimir. So, so, uh, let's just um, get rid of that one and let's put you back in the barn let's put you in the barn level 2 as a farmer so you can get back to work there they do good work and Bogna uh, Wigbert barn worker da, 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 da. which barn are you? barn level 1 Okay, you're the one little barn worker in that little place Okay, uh, you have a daughter of 0 your wife, mother that's Iwona. Iwona is kind of the mother. And Wigbert is the father. Um, so do we have anybody else who is who used to be a good farm worker? Nobody else, right? There's only this level. Bogma. Bogna is an animal breeder. What what kind of um, you're living in the, you're working the pigsty. Uh, 
I wish I could move you, but I need the pigs. <laughs> uh, Wigbert, I need you as a farm worker as well. Animal breeder, Emmerich. Let's see, you're the goose house. So I can I can get rid of that. Let's just get you out of that. Let's put you in the barn. Don't really care much about the uh, the geese anyway. So we got a farmer there, farmer there. And then we have Bernard, Ber Berard, who's near zero years old. I don't think he can hold anything at the moment. So let's leave him alone. Farmer, 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 barn worker, animal breeder. Okay, so that one is a mother. So I need to leave. I can't take her out of that situation. Animal breeder. What kind of animal breeder? You're the hen house. Okay, fine. Uh, barn worker, Kanuta and Prejwuj. Prejwuj. I'm not quite sure how to say that. Henrika, you're in the fold. I need you there. Leonard. Leonardo. Leonardo. Leonardo's a mother. And this is this guy is a hunter. Baldwin is a hunter. So if we can move one of these guys to become a farm worker, that'll be good. He's already working in the barn level two, so that's good. Barn level two as a farmer. Perfect. So we'll have we'll have two people working in, in the farming. So let's see. Uh, we have two farmers in level, the level one. Good. And we have two people... Farmer, farmer, farmer. Yeah, the happiness is going to go down because he was he was way happier working in a different field than this one. But it'll be fine. And uh, Kanuta, I think I'm going to work on that person's happiness, get it above into the 50s and stuff like that. Uh, I think the, the reason, the, the way to get the higher... All right, so my thinking is that the happier they are, right, uh, the higher tier work they would they the fact they they go up in tiers i'm not quite sure that's true but that's my uh, that's my thinking yeah i mean i that's what i would program <laughs> i'm not sure if that's the, the fact but it's, that's true but that's why I, that's how i think it services tool stand yeah you don't have any work anymore so let's go get rid of you so you can get rid of these all these demands and stuff i mean this is my highest grossing stall it gets a lot of money um, but I just don't have anybody else to work on this 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 thing. So, and of, of course, once we have done all of the quests, we should have an additional. I mean, it's, it's like what? See how many how many quests do we have? Two here, four. What's this one over here? Journal, pay taxes. Okay, that's the pay taxes thing. Yeah, yeah, I, I get it. I get it. So we have to go pay the taxes, of course. So we have one, two, three, four, five. Five, six. We have Branica as well. Six quests um, of 60 each. So I think we should be able to get uh, quite a bit of points. I'm not going to do the math. You can do the math for you. <laughs> Never do math in, 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 uh, in, on a YouTube video. That's for sure. Um, it's, it's really bad. Just don't do that. Just don't do it. And we'll have lots of fruit coming in. And I think that we're... What, what are you? Oh, you're a little gooseling. Ah, a little gosling. Perfect. Of course, now nobody's taking care of the geese. So we'll have a bit of a problem with eggs and feathers here. Don't get angry with me. <laughs> I'm in charge of you. Anyways, that's it for this episode. We grew a little bit better um, and more. We got a little bit further in the tech tier. We got level 3 food. Uh, we're going to go do some more farming. I am think I'm just, this is going to just keep on going. We, have, we need a lot of points to be able to uh, get to the... Uh, to the windmill the first up is level three barn we'll get that first and then the windmill and then we will see what happens anyways that's it for now uh, i hope you enjoyed the episode if you did leave a like if you did leave a dislike it's fine i uh, will see you in the next one where we will most likely go um quest hunting we'll get all the quests gather them all up and uh, see if we do can do a couple of them yeah we'll, we'll just go walk around the, the cloud a little of the map and uh, see what we can do. We can also do a little bit of hunting. Anyways, see you. Have a nice afternoon. Bye-bye.